Today, we will tell you a story about a really special witch. She's Wednesday Adam, a cold girl with a genius brain. One time, Wednesday accidentally read a story about Rapunzel. She was really interested in a kind of flower which was grown up from the light drop of the sun. Then Wednesday determined to study to create that kind of flower. After so many days of hard work, a flower of the sun finally bloomed. <laughs> Suddenly, Wednesday was attacked by her mischievous brother. Not backing down, she quickly fought back. Their fight accidentally malfunctioned the time machine on which Wednesday was working. The machine suddenly opened the gate, which captured her. Wednesday was driven to a really strange place. While thinking about that place, Wednesday was suddenly attacked by a stranger. Turned out, that was a castle of tangled princess Rapunzel. Who are you? How did you get here? Are you trying to take my magical hair away? I'm not interested in that Tawardy hair. So you come here to harm me? Yeah! <laughs> For some complicated reason, so I lost to here. If I want to harm you, you will not be able to do anything to me. Then Wednesday told Rapunzel the whole story about the origin of her hair. was actually a lost princess. <laughs> and her mother was only taking advantage of her magical hair to hold her youth back. <laughs> you fool me! My mother is not a bad person! If I'm not mistaken, then today is your birthday, right? Annually, on this day, the king will launch the flying lanterns into the sky to pray that they can find the princess. If you don't believe, I can take you there to see. Turned out those stars? Called flying lanterns? But if you tell me the truth whether my parents can recognize me? Just rest assured your hair is unique, so they will be able to recognize you for sure. But why do you want to help me? I want to take something from the king's place. Hesitating for a while, Rapunzel finally decided to leave the tower which had been detaining her for years to go find her real parents. The extremely long hair made it difficult for Rapunzel to move. Then Wednesday decided to get her a new hairstyle. <laughs> <laughs> Reaching near the palace, Rapunzel was amazed by the bustling things there. It's wonderful here. Human is not scary as my mother used to say. Huh? Then she was attracted by a painting on the wall. This is your real family. You insolent thief! Stop there! Suddenly, the thief rushed there and smashed into Rapunzel. The crown he had stolen was sticked tight into Rapunzel's hair. Stop there! He had no other choice but to take her to run away with him. And Wednesday had to follow them. Seeing the guards kept chasing them, Wednesday certainly thought about the way to help them escape. Huh? <laughs> 
<laughs> After a while, they finally lost the guards. Huh? Mm. <clears throat> when that guy wanted to take the crown back and left, Rapunzel realized that the crown was really familiar. This is my crown? Huh? You're a thief? Hmm. <laughs> huh? You're hilarious, but I don't have huh? time to play with you. <laughs> I will never let you take it away. You are Flynn Rider. How do you know it? Like in the book, you're her destiny. I will never marry a thief. I can also never love a fierce girl like you. Mm. When they were fighting for the crown, the witch who had detained Rapunzel suddenly appeared. Mother! Hmm? No! You're not my mother! What are you talking about? I'm your mother. Why didn't you listen to me? Why did you leave that tower? Do you know that there are a lot of dangers waiting for you outside? Quickly, come back with me. I knew it all! Huh? Don't try to fool me anymore! <coughs> the world outside is not scary as what you said! On the contrary, you're the most scary person! <laughs> Taking advantage huh? of the distraction of Rapunzel, <laughs> Flynn immediately took the crown and <laughs> ran away. But a loud noise resounded, making him stop. <laughs> he guessed that the two girls were <laughs> in trouble. I don't know why, but I feel that I cannot ignore that. Ugh, I'm really crazy. Even mm. hesitated for a while, Flynn still decided to come back to help the girls. <laughs> Seeing Flynn so annoyed, she immediately attacked him with critical hits. At that moment, Whence they certainly remembered that the witch's longevity came from Rapunzel's magical hair. Whence they rushed there and cut down Rapunzel's huh? hair. No! Huh? When the hair was cut, the witch also disappeared immediately. <laughs> About Flynn, who was badly wounded, his huh? breath was gradually getting huh? weaker. Why did you do that? It's not like what a thief do. I don't really understand why, but there was something inside me that compelled me to protect you. <laughs> My hair was cut down. How can I save you? Can I ask you a favor? Yes, tell me. Uh, please, help me maintain the fund for the orphanage, or the kids will... <coughs> So that's the reason why you wanted to steal the crown? All right, I agree to help hmm. those kids. Right at that moment, the space huh? around them gradually faded huh? and vanished. What's happening? Can it be? Everything is gradually vanishing because the end of the story was changed? Rapunzel, huh? kiss him. The kiss of real love will hmm. save him. Hmm. Rapunzel did what Wednesday had said. But there was no miracle happen. Huh? Huh? If things don't happen in the right sequence, Rapunzel doesn't have any feeling with Flynn, so the kiss didn't work. <laughs> Maybe I have to use it now. Wednesday took out the magical flower, which he had taken a lot of time to study it. <laughs> Let's see. Huh? When she was still saying, the portal opened huh? and brought Wednesday away. It turned out that thing, the yeah. pet of Adam's family, had studied her writings and successfully opened the gate again to bring her back. Wednesday hastily found the book and opened the last page. <laughs> Seeing Flynn and Rapunzel together, Wednesday breathed a sigh of relief. Once upon a time, there was a prosperous kingdom where people lived a peaceful life together. However, one day, when it's dark, many dark entities appeared and attacked them. They believed that the magic relics had created those entities. 
Therefore, magic was forbidden in this kingdom. All the wizards were exported from the kingdom forever. And normal people had to live within the protection wall of the kingdom. Lux was a beautiful girl who had been born in a royal family. Her father was really loyal to the king. He even exported his own wife from the kingdom when seeing her use magic. Garen, her brother, was really talented. Lux always admired her brother. Lux and Garen are expected to be the potential heir of the family. Therefore, since they had been kids, they had to learn many things, especially about horse riding and fencing. But Lux was never interested in those things. Deep inside her, there was always a call for her to discover new things. One day, being too tired after getting the rebukes from her master, Lux came up with an idea. She wanted to go out to discover the world beyond that protection wall. She took the command tag from her father and used it to get out of the kingdom easily. When Lux was enjoying the beautiful scenery, her horse accidentally slipped and fell off the cliff. Fortunately, Lux didn't get injured, but her horse wasn't lucky like that. His leg was broken and he couldn't move. Oh, my poor horse, if I leave you here, you won't make it through. What should I do now? When the last sunshine had gone away, the dark entities appeared and attacked her. Despite the dangers, Garen looked for his sister for the whole night. And finally, in the early morning, he found her lying next to the horse. Looking at the burn marks around her, Garen could predict something, but he decided to keep silent. When everything was all right, he came to ask Lux about the night before. Huh? Knowing that she wouldn't be able to lie, Lux told her brother the truth. That night, huh? when the dark entities huh? attacked, our mom's necklace gave me the light power. Thanks to it, I could defeat the dark entities and made them run away. You are not allowed to use it in any way ever again. If you get caught, not only you, but our whole family will be in danger. I... I'm sorry. Hmm. However, after knowing that she can use magic, Lux could feel that this is the thing she had been looking for. After the fencing practice, she found the way to get out of the kingdom to practice magic. She gradually knew the way how to use light magic. Suddenly, she saw a dark figure, hooded and cloaked, wandering out of the protection wall. It's so weird. He's not the guard. Why is he wandering here? Hmm. Magic? A witch is around here, right out of the protection wall? What is he doing here? Lux carefully followed the stranger to the end of the tunnel. The scene before her eyes really astonished her. The dark entities were created continuously. Moreover, the energy for creating them was supplied by the wizards which had been exported before, including her mother. Surprisingly, the hooded boss realized her. She quickly used her light power to attack him, making him injured in the right hand. Then she immediately ran away. Lux quickly went back to tell her father and brother what she had just seen. 
but she didn't know that the dark entities had already followed. Dark entities? Why could they enter the castle? Being the best warriors in the kingdom, her father and her brother still got exhausted because the dark entities had outnumbered them. Seeing her father and her brother in danger, Lux had no choice but use her magic to struck them out. Lux, how dare you use magic? Guard, quickly huh? huh? capture huh? Lux the wizard. I had mercy on you, wizard, but you never appreciated that. You kept using magic. Your mother had been exported. How could you forget it so quickly? Your majesty, my sister is still young and dumb. Please, have mercy on her. Please, forgive her. Begging is useless. For my people, I have to export Lux from here forever. Huh? <laughs> Lux, what are you doing? <gasps> Lux told everyone what she had seen in that cave. When seeing the king only use left hand instead of right hand, I doubted about it, so I had to risk it. Of course I made it deviate to one side intentionally. If there was nothing to dodge for him, he could never get injured. Your Majesty, how do you explain about this? Why did you create them? I created them to protect all of you weak people. You think with your little talent you can fight against other great kingdoms? Long ago, when I discussed with the Supreme Wizard about creating the dark entities, but that damn wizard rejected it, so I had to do it by myself. Isn't those entities able to protect the kingdom? Why did he reject? Because the dark entities can only survive by sucking people's life spirit. Some years ago, your mother secretly investigated about this, and she had told me her suspicions, but I didn't believe her because I had been too loyal. I even made her get caught and exported from the kingdom. So that's the reason why people always feel tired every night? How dare you consider human as a source of food? You're always selfish like that. You all want to have a peaceful life, but you don't want to sacrifice anything. I won't let anyone ruin this plan. If my dark army grows strong enough, other great kingdoms will have to kneel before me. The king summoned plenty of dark entities to cover him, making him bigger and stronger. Although having the light power, but there were so many dark entities they took turns to fill the hole that she had created. Lux and her father were gradually exhausted. They couldn't fight against the king anymore. Suddenly, there was a light power coming to save them. It was Lux's mother, and beside her, there were also Garen and other wizards which had been captured by the king. At that time, when seeing the dangerous situation, Garen silently left. He went to the place that Lux mentioned before. It turned out that Garen had also inherited a part of his mother's power. It's not so much, but it's enough for him to open the gate which led to the secret place for the king. He rescued his mother and other <laughs> wizards and asked them to go there and save his father and sister. <laughs> Lux, I and other people here will give our power. Use it to purify all the dark things in this kingdom. <laughs> 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 
She immediately used all of her power to make a critical hit. That light finally purified all the dark entities. After being defeated, the king was put into dark dungeon immediately. The kingdom was ruled by a new regime, which accepted the wizards and used their magic to help the kingdom. Once again, their life was peaceful as before. <laughs>